forgot I, oh my God, there's lipstick all over my back now. <gasps> hey guys, welcome to my channel. So first I think we'll address the big elephant in the room. My hair, I definitely did a big change on my hair. I was just so tired of having long bra, bra. Huh? I was just so tired of having long brown hair. I've had long brown hair my whole life. I never dyed my hair. I just went to the salon and I was like, let's sombre my hair. <laughs> it's more darker in the back. Um, and then up front we have like lots of lighter pieces that come up higher. So when you look at me straight on, it almost looks like I just have blonde hair, but it's ombre and then I have a little bit of darkness through here. I do have my extensions coming in the mail. Oh, because I definitely had to get new ones and I'm excited to try those out in my hair, but I don't know, it's such a big change for me, but I like it, I'm happy with it, and let me know what you guys think about the fro, the new hairdo. <laughs> Today's video is going to be another dupe video, and it's not just gonna involve MAC lipsticks this time, it's gonna involve a lot of different high-end brand lipsticks. We have YSL, we do have MAC, uh, we have a Lorac, a Kat Von D, just high-end lipsticks that I found dupes for. And again, I found perfect dupes for them that are so, 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 so cheap. So I'm very excited to share them with you guys. I know you're gonna love them. I'm actually wearing one of the dupes right now. So I'm very excited to share them with you guys. I worked all morning on finding these dupes. So I had my hands painted in lipsticks and I had used like a hundred of my little wipes cleaning myself. If you saw my makeup desk right now, you would faint. There's, it, it, it's horrible. I could barely get ready. <sighs> the work was well worth it because we have more dupes. And if you're excited about seeing these dupes, well then please just keep watching. <sighs> the first dupe I want to talk about is Rebel by Mac. This is a super popular color. I think like almost everybody loves Rebel. And my packaging's a little bit different because I did get this one in the Heirloom Mix collection for the holidays. But again, it's just Rebel, and this is a beautiful purpley color, and I found an exact match for Rebel. So this is Wine and Dine. This is a high voltage lipstick by NYX, and these little mama jamas, they just match perfectly, and I'm so obsessed with them. I didn't even realize I had a match in my collection. Um, I probably wouldn't have bought Rebel if I knew, but I didn't have this one yet because I already had Rebel, so... That worked out. For the exact same, don't go spend money on Rebel. Or if you can't find Rebel because I know it's sold out all the time, don't panic. Just go get Wine and Dine by NYX. This is a high voltage lip sticky. The next two is this is Lorac's Alter Ego Lipstick and this one is in Sex Kitten and this is a holy grail product for springtime. Everybody needs a beautiful bold pink to wear for all spring months. Which I know is still snowing in places which just baffles me because it's just sunny all year round here. And even when I lived in Alabama it doesn't really snow there so what does that even mean? How do you guys survive in the snow? I know I couldn't. Anyways, back to lipsticks. Sex Kitten by uh, Lorac. And then we have Jordana's Modern Matte Lipstick. This one is in Matte Popular. Now, the tricky thing about these are they actually don't look alike in the packaging. But I find that the Jordana Modern Matte Lipsticks, they come off a little bit different than what they actually look like in the package. So, with that being said, it came off more so looking like the Lorac Alter Ego. And they are a beautiful, perfect match. And they're both matte lipsticks. So they even have that same texture. Yes, girl. My next tip is the one that I'm most excited about because I love this color. I know a lot of people don't want to wear bright orange lipstick. This is Kat Von D Studded Lipstick in a Go-Go. And this is just orange. I don't know how else to describe it other than like orange. So I did find a perfect dupe for it. This is the High Voltage by NYX again lipstick and then this one is in Free Spirit. So the only slight difference I found was Free Spirit by NYX was just like more shiny rather than the Kat Von D because most of the or like all of the Kat Von D's are really leaning towards a matte lipstick but they are dupes. They really, they just look just alike. They're so awesome. And these are a little bit expensive. They're like 21, I think. I may be wrong. I'll look. But I think these are like 21. So this is a super good dupe for this. I did find a, uh, 
I did find a dupe for Gerard's Berry Smoothie. This is Gerard's brand new lipstick that just came out. And I'm very excited about it, but I, I didn't realize how close it is to Touch of Spice. And I know a ton of people were like, Touch of Spice is the perfect dupe for Jaclyn Hills 1995. Uh-uh, girlfriend, it is not. It is a perfect dupe for Berry Smoothie. If you swipe 1995 and then this Touch of Spice down your hand, there is a bit of a color difference. I mean, they are very similar, but they're not exact. And I found that Berry Smoothie and Touch of Spice are exact and they're both matte so that again they have that same texture this is its twin sister but one is a little bit more pricey Yay! they are now friends because they're the exact same color most expensive and cheapest dupe <laughs> i have um my favorite like nude lipstick this is ysl's rouge per couture number 10. i feel like whenever you read ysl's lipstick titles you need to say them like that <laughs> <laughs> Overpriced lipstick. <laughs> so I do love this lipstick though. It is pretty awesome. I'm not going to lie. But I did find a dupe. So you ain't got to go out and spend $35 on one lipstick. Oh, uh-uh. Its dupe is actually a Jordana lipstick. And it's a modern matte. Um, and then this one is in matte blush. And this is number 02. And they're the exact same. I really wanted to find a dupe for this one just because it's my most expensive lipstick that I own. So I was like, challenge accepted. I mean, it's just a nude lipstick. People just hype things up. Like, I'm hyping this up right now because I love it. But, I mean, you don't have to go out and spend all your money. It's not necessary. Go get freaking matte blush and be like, hey, y'all, I got my Rue Percator on. Okay. And no one would be able to tell the difference. Lastly, I have my last nude. How many nudes did I do? So I only did two nudes. I love nude lipsticks. <laughs> Max Blankety. It is like a weird nude, nude color because it's so mauve-y and I really love this color. And I found a NYX High Voltage lipstick. I'm sorry a lot of these dupes are the NYX High Voltage, but these are just awesome. This one is in stone, but these, I mean, I immediately knew it was a dupe. They freaking look just alike. They are the exact same. They have that same amplified color and the same high shine to them. They the same thing, girl. Don't be fooled. You just need your next on, which is so amazing because I love this color a lot and it's been neglected and now I feel like I'm just going to use my next stone. I love these. They're so moisturizing and as I've preached to you guys, I got the crackiest lips on this side of California. So this, these are awesome for that. If you have dry lips, go for the um, high voltage lipsticks by NYX. They are going to be your holy grail. <coughs> Um, yeah, that's that's all my dupes. But if you guys want me to film more dupe videos involving other things than lipsticks, maybe lip glosses, blushes, bronzers, powders, I don't know. I can come up with them, man. I just gotta do a little bit of research, but I can come up with them. Let me know what you guys want to see, and let me know if you like this video by giving it a thumbs up if you did. I love you guys. Be sure to check out the down bar for all my social media. You can follow me on Instagram, you can follow me on Twitter, and you can follow me on Facebook. You can even Snapchat me. Most of the time I Snapchat back, or I'll just type you a little message back when I'm looking extra crusty. Thank you for watching. I hope to see you all in the next video. Bye guys!